Hey guys, this is Coach Chris. Welcome to my channel where we break down international level fights for strategies and tactics that you can use in your own matches. Today we're breaking down Park versus Alessio um, and in the Grand Prix. I think there's another Grand Prix that's, that just came out and I'm going to be looking at those pretty soon. Um, but this one looked pretty spicy 30 seconds in, so let's get into it. I'm going to turn this guy down because I don't want him to commentate because I'm watching the fight. Nice punch. Nice. Trying to score on the inside as well. That was a good, uh, a good out in by the world champion there. Make sure we're fast forwarding here. I'm pretty sure they, they gave it to him, right? Yep. Okay. Give him the three points. Not surprising. My GR free is bad, but Roma um, is in Italy, and he's fighting Italy. Italy trying to fight him in place right now. Standing his ground. Nice by Park. Good follow-up there. I like that Park is maintaining the forward pressure. Or at least was. How did he score here? Um, I was just as I did it, or just as I, as I said it, I, he was maintaining forward pressure, got the points. Alessio not taking that at all, and so he's one on the offense. I don't know how he scored, to be honest here. Yeah, that was weird. I don't know how how he scored two points. Maybe something underneath when he who went for the head. Cut. Nice. Looking for another punch, I think. Park's looking for another punch. Good offense here by Alessio. Oh, buddy. Okay, so I don't know if... I, I, I remember I covered Park, and then I stopped doing a little bit of videos, and then I read and then i started doing them doing them again i don't know if park's natural style is to cancel the front leg or if he's canceling specifically specifically because alessio's front leg is so deadly uh, i mean obviously it's at this level like everyone's front leg is deadly but there's a difference between it being so deadly that it forces a defense out of you and it being deadly as like you just have to watch out for it as, as he attacks i'm alessio won essentially with just his with, with his front leg uh, and uh, 2019, I think it was the last one I watched. 2019 World Champs. So it could be that they said he's he's scary. He can go deep with it. You fight him in place. You cancel, and then you can you can fight him toe to toe. So I don't I don't know if that's what. Nice follow up punch here by the. Hold on, I'm, I'm, like Park is just racking up points. So I'm I'm trying to pause and break down what's happening, what I'm seeing, um, and how he's doing it, and and there's just action all over so boom he scored on the back side off one of these kicks off of not that one not that one off off the cancel he scored off the cancel like the cancel and still flicked it onto the hogu after uh, is the score delayed I think this. I think the scoring is delayed. So it was one of the other ones plus one. Then Alessio gets a punch in. Yeah, I would. I would be so confused too. Like, how are points going up here? Sorry about the ads. Let's see. Little testing. I feel a punch, another punch coming. At least one side's looking for it. For the punch, interesting. They stopped scoring punch. Oh my god, what the heck? Bro, and it didn't score. Neither of those scored. Oh man. Prevented either one. I'd be so like... 
I would also be flabbergasted. I would be flabbergasted. Um, slow mo it one. And he, but he blocked the other kick though, so it could be that the first one didn't have enough contact or enough pressure, and then he blocked the second kick. Good of part. Holy cow, this man. Good defense. Yeah, I would. I would call for the. So there's gonna be a call for the head kick probably, and then a call for holding. Oh, oh, they. Yeah, they gave it. To, well, of course they gave it to him. They want Rome to win in Rome Grand Prix here, or uh, Italy. Okay. I just got to watch that front leg. I mean, leading with a cancel. You might be able to do the Iranian punch. Okay. This is a spicy one. Double kick. Double. Front leg double. Front leg double. Iranian punch. You can't let him do the punch. You can't let him punch. Oh, they're going to give it to him because it's Italy. Okay, okay. He fell, though. <sighs> oh, he won because the head kicks. I'd be upset if I were part. Okay, let's see. Let's see how Park handles round two. I like this. I lo okay. Yeah, I was going to say, okay. So this is, so something I noticed from you guys is you can't just bluff. You have to go if you're threatening to go. So here, forward pressure, right? Forward pressure again. If you do that and then you don't do anything, then your opponent's going to know you're full of crap. Um, you're not actually going to go. So I see you guys uh, do the forward pressure and then you guys do forward pressure and then you guys don't do anything. Uh, I'm not saying everyone. This is just some videos I've watched. Sometimes you guys apply the forward pressure, apply forward pressure. If they don't go, you got to go to let them know you're serious about your forward pressure. If if you just do that and then you kind of wait, then then your phone knows you're full of crap. So I like that Park went there. Nice double. Keep them there. They're not. They're not gonna. So in this situation. Um, this is more for like when you're international already, or if there's a, if there's a crowd favorite, you don't have to, I guess, be international, but if there's a crowd favorite, then the punches that you throw are, are, and you're not the crowd favorite, the punches you throw are probably not going to count. And the punches they throw are probably going to count more often than yours are. Uh, so either you have to do a really, really good job selling your punches, or you have to find a way to score that doesn't include punches. Uh, but just just keep that in mind. Home tips for you guys. Good. Oh, it's so crazy. The holding is real though, but they're not gonna call that. Now you're holding after holding after the fact, um, but not before because of course that would negate his point. Double again. Double again. Oh, nice try. That's not. I think that might be hard to reach, dude. That's such a threatening little out in crescent from his left. I wonder if you could trap that with a hook kick. If you go forward, then switch into a back kick after. This guy's really trying. Like, I think for Alessio, um, I like his defense against Park here. Oh, he got it. I was gonna say for Alessio though, in order to hit this crescent kick, I mean they've already wised up. This left leg's coming out. You gotta throw it to the body a couple times. At least threaten that it might go to the body, so it changes where he's he's um, where he's blocking, and then you can go back to the head. But right now, Park has it down packed. He's he's. All, I also like that he's not taking this lying down. He's like, I'm still trying to win here. No, no, no. <laughs> took it away. No. Oh, buddy. I feel like they're gonna they're gonna award it. They might award it. This is a tough uphill battle he's got here. Uh, sorry for all the ads, guys. Oh, uh, I don't think he's gonna take this one. Let's see. 
Mmm. Okay. So, he got a chance. But given the amount of runtime left in this video, I feel like it's not going to look well for Park. Boom. Park. But oh, sorry, Park. I was going to say punch. Or throw that left. Throw your throw your right foot. Throw your right foot so he can't throw his left. Throw your right so he can't throw his left. Pushing without kick. Oh, that was pretty nasty by uh, Alessia. I'm sorry. That's kind of rough that it didn't score. That was really well. That was pretty accurate. Good for him. Watch that right. There we go. He's starting to throw the body again. Oh, he tried for the punch. I'm trying to think what Alessio's like trying to do right now, you know? Okay. Oh, that's true. He has no card. There's no more card. You lost the card. Okay. Finally hit it. That was nuts. So, a lot of right leg. Tried it again. And try for the second one. Let's oh, there's no video replay. I would video replay that for sure. That's time. That's that's uh game turning. Three away. No, no. Okay, he's keeping the three points. No card. Yep, that's what I would do. Double spin. No, 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 not one. No, oh, good spin on on Alessio's part though. Dang. That was pretty, pretty nuts and really close. Um, so overall, I think great fight, good pressure, good, good, great forward pressure by Park. I got, I have no qualms against the way he was doing that. Uh, I think for him, I mean, obviously he's focusing on trying to get more points. So that little head slip in um, from the right side, it's so or from Alessio's left, his coming in, coming on from his right was is really sneaky. It's really, really hard to defend that kind of thing. Uh, multiple times because it, it wraps around weird so i think every time he, i don't know if alessio has um i don't i'm sorry i don't know if park has a lot of training against that kind of a crescent kick um so it, and and though alessio did switch to the body for a little bit before going to the head multiple times so i think that's part of why it snuck in great great front leg by alessio great back leg to the head and back leg out in crescent kick um Overall, great match by these two guys. I'm trying to think comment-wise. The strategy shifted a little bit more for um, for Park, kind of in the in the second round here, where he's uh, he fought a little bit more offensively against. He, yeah, he fought a little bit more going forward versus fighting uh, in place in the first round, uh, and it was to his advantage up until the last few seconds. Good on Alessio though to to find those little. Find those little nuances uh, and spaces to score. Overall, this is a pretty exciting match. Um, and uh, watching these guys play, I hope you guys learned something.